Daedric signs or Daedra cuts worship Daedra. Bad people who summon bad Daedra. Stand up. Mm -hmm. There you go. What? You were dreaming. Where am I? What's your name? Where am I? What's my name? I'm Brandar. And you are? Well, not even last night's storm could wait. Jube. I heard them say the we touched mine. I'm sure they'll let us go. Yeah, let us go. That's great for a Dunmer. What does a Khajiit have Quiet. to do in Morrowind? This is where you get off. Come with me. Get off. Get it? <laughs> you better do what they say. Ah, you're no fun. You're no fun. Nice place you got here, Guardy. Didn't really get a good look as I was being uh, blindfolded and tossed down the stairs. I preferred my nice, comfortable selling elsewhere. Orcs Rest is not a bad place. I can only wait to see what mess you've brought me to. Uh, no nothing. No nothing! No wine for your guests! No cheese, no fish, no milk. You're monsters. Monsters. Get yourself up on deck and let's keep this as simple I understand as why you're angry and it's quite fine, sir. I'd be mad too if I ate, like, nothing all the time and slept in a hammock on a shitty boat. The sooner you leave, the sooner we can move on. Well, I thought we could get a room for the night together, you and me, kitten. And we could bed down for a little while. Yes, confused? Uh, I think... We're all waiting. I'm not confused, you're confused. I just, I just wanted the yes or a no. You know, I think I deserve Death. that. No, Jesus, I know where I'm not wanted. Alright, you guys enjoy your stinky boat. I'll see you. Oh. My God. I rather like the trees. But look at all that water. What desolate swamp have they dumped me into? Why would I be snatched up from a prison and dumped into a swamp? <sighs> By the gods. This doesn't seem fair at all. This is where they want you. Head down to the dock and I'll show you to the census office. Census? I'm not sure I want to be a part of a country so wet. Do you like it here, Red God? What do you think? Have you been to elsewhere? Can you compare Let's the two? Go. Move it oh, along. Okay. Nobody wants to talk to me. I guess you have places to go. Hello, sir. Are you more cordial? I hope. Arrived, but our records don't show from where. From where? From elsewhere. You don't recognize a Khajiit when you see one? Maybe you don't have the Outlanders come this way so often. But that's all right. You shall sir, soon lear learn to love Brandar. Great. I'm sure you'll fit right in. I've been Follow drinking me up to some the skooma. <laughs> Me and the Dunmer. Ah! What can you tell me about this place? Oh, you're very disciplined, are you? Head on in. Head on in. Thank you, sir. I'll do just that. Ah, quite a nice little setup in here. Ah, yes, we've been expecting have you. Have you? Uh, you'll have to be recorded before you're officially can released. you tell me what's happening? There are a few ways we can do this, and the choice is okay, yours. Okay, I'll just disregard what I'm saying completely. Give me these forms. I'll fill them out myself. My athletics and acrobatic skills are quite good, having uh, seen quite a few countries. Though I've never been here, and I, I believe there's a specific reason for that. I do also have a gift for a couple of magic schools, mysticism and alteration. I actually find quite useful as a bard. Uh, I'm not really one for the destruction, though. Very good. The letter that preceded you mentioned you were born under a certain sign. And what would that be? Uh, my sign is that of the lady, my lord. <laughs> Interesting. Now, before I stamp these papers, make sure this information is correct. Brandar the Khajiit. Yes, looks pretty good to me. 50 in acrobatics. Ooh, that's really nice. It feels good to stretch my legs once more. Hmm. 
show your papers to the captain when you exit to get your release fee. Indeed I shall. I thank you, Sozia Zagalia. It doesn't roll off the tongue. For release by Emperor Uriel... Emperor Uriel Septum? Wow. The Emperor has sent for my release. Well, I think they shall write songs about that. To the district of Vardenfell in the province of Morrowind. Well, I suppose we shall uh, be off to see the Emperor then. It's like the Prince and the Pauper. My goodness. Let's see if we can't come around this way. What's in your chest? Show me your chest, boys. <laughs> Ooh. Limeware platter. I think I can get this. You've made your last mistake, thief. Continue through to the next building and talk to Celis Gravius. Oh, you've you've given me some uh, some liberty, and I do appreciate that. Thank you so much. That will be enough to give us a nice little start, won't it? Oh, these are all quite valuable, aren't they? If I was uh, to read the history of the Empire. I'm not really one for books, I suppose. I'm one for coin. Whether it's through song or uh, more deft means. I don't particularly enjoy combat now. Some bread. Got a uh, meat. A uh, silver. Silver. I don't mind a little silver once in a while. Oh, and a potion. Well, you have something else for Brandar? Paper says nothing. I leave you. Well, I guess it says nothing because it's in the bottom of a bread basket. It's serving its purpose. Ah, I amuse myself. The warrior, the mage, the thief. The lady is one of the warrior's charges, and her season is heart fire. Those born under the sign of the lady are kind and tolerant. I believe that suits me. I'm relatively kind, except, uh, sometimes I see opportunity, and you are a fool if opportunity knocks and you do not answer, either out of fear, baskets, like a soul gem, I'm not really one for the magical arts, but, uh, I know a good value when I see one. I think we are done here. Farewell. Ah, more baskets. I do love a good basket. Can practice my alchemy, perhaps? And here we are. Beer roll, I can check. Healing ring. Once again, not one for the magic, but uh, I know a good value. Wonderful. Your papers, oh, please. Oh, goodness, you are prompt, aren't you? Celis Gravius, hello, my name is Bran Dar. It means Bran the Clever. First, let me take your identification papers. Thank you. Word of your arrival only reached me yesterday. I'm Celis Gravius, but my background is not important. I'm here to welcome you to Morrowind. Well, I should like to know the background of the one who is welcoming me, Mr. Gravius. Please, tell me. I'm Cells Gravius, Knight Errant of the Imperial Legion. Knight Errant? Quite a rank, huh? Well, uh, what, what do you have to tell me about Morrowind? Yes, you're in Morrowind. I don't know why you're here, or why you were released from prison and shipped here, but your authorization comes directly from Emperor Uriel Septim himself. I don't need to know any more than that. When you leave this office, you're free. But before you go, I have instructions on your duties. Instructions from the Emperor, so pay careful attention. Well, duties, I'm not, uh, extremely fond of this word. 
But I suppose I owe you something in exchange for my freedom, and it would be quite foolish of me to deny the Emperor. So, uh, tell me what you know of these duties, please, Mr. Gravius. This package came with the news of your arrival. You're to take it to Caius Cassades in the town of Balmora. Go to the South Wall Corner Club and ask for Caius Cassades. They'll know where to find him. Serve him as you would serve the Emperor himself. I also have a letter for you and a dispersal to your name. I thank you very much. 87 gold is not a bad start. Uh, although I did not receive any of my equipment when I was let off the boat. I don't know too much about the town of Valmora, except that they have uh, quite good skooma. <laughs> but perhaps you could enlighten me just a little more about what to expect. Valmora is north of St. Denis. The road passes Pelgriad Village and Fort Pelgriad, crosses a deep ravine, passes Fort Moonmoth, then turns west onto Odai River and into Balmora. The South Wall Corner Club is in Southeast Balmore, on the east side of the river. For more detailed directions, talk to Elone the Scout at Ariel's Trade House here in St. Denis. But take my advice, you're new here. Take the Silt Stride to the Balmora. Fast, cheap, safe. Cross the bridge and head east. Can't miss it. Silt Strider, uh, is this the giant insect that I happen to pass on my way in? Tell me more, is this completely safe? Still strangers carry passengers and cargo between settlements on Vardenfeld. Fares depend on distance to be traveled. Silt striders are giant insects. A compartment for passengers and cargo is hollowed out from the creature's shell. The driver directs the beast by directly manipulating exposed organs and tissues. Silt striders travel between Alderun, Balmora, Sedanin, Surad, Nissus, Kul, Molagmar, Margon, and North Landing near Vivek. That uh, disturbs me quite a bit, Mr. Gravius. This driver really manipulates the tissues inside of the insect. Perhaps I will walk, I think. That's uh, quite interesting, quite disgusting, really. I, I think I need to go now. Maybe throw up a little bit. <sighs> I don't know how I'm going to fit in this place. I'm on my own now. Wonderful. Well, hello to the wood elf who decides to ignore me. How about you, guard? I'm an officer of the Imperial Legion. Move along. Oh, aren't you the cheeky one, huh? We have garrisons at Fort Pelgiad and Pelgiad, Ho Ho Hawkmoth Fort and Evenheart, Fort Moonmoth and Balmora, Fort Buckmoth and Alrun, Fort Darius and Nisus. Where were you looking to enjoy join the Imperial Legion? Would you be so quick to take on a Khajiit? That is quite interesting to me. No, I think I will wait and learn a little bit more about this Imperial Legion. I know they've uh, put Cyrodiil into quite a mess at some points. Goodbye, guard. Best of luck. Ah, oh, the Wood Elf! Interesting. Go on. Are you the one the boat? Are you the one the boat dropped off? Odd to see a boat arrive at that time of the day. Hope the Imperials treated you okay. I swear they took my ring. And what ring is that, my Wood Elf friend? I swear one of the guards has it. I had it last week before their weekly Let's Shake Down Fargoth ritual. An engraved healing ring, a family heirloom of mine. You haven't seen it, have you? I uh, found this ring in a barrel. Perhaps it is yours. You found it. Amazing. Thank you. Thank you. You're now my favorite friend. I'll be sure to tell the others, especially my friend Ariel, who runs the trade house here. Go see him. He'll be happy to see you now. I'm so glad we could work something out, my friend. It is so wonderful to make contacts in the new town. Perhaps you could tell me of some of the uh, latest rumors around here, now that you're a bit more predisposed to me. I'm not a stranger. I heard there's some trouble at Force Frostmoth. Never heard of it? It's on an island called Solstheim, no north of Ardenfell. Solstheim? I believe there's an Imperial Fort up there, Fort Frostmouth or something. If you want to go there, check around and cool. There may be a ship that'll take you. Quite interesting. Could you tell me a secret? Daedra? You know what they are, right? Well, Daedra signs are where Daedra cuts worship Daedra. Bad people who summon bad Daedra. Stay away from them. Why? 
Castadra are nasty, and the folks that worship them are even nastier. I suppose that is a uh, good advice, perhaps? We don't have that problem a bit further south. I thank you for your time, Wood Elf. You've been uh, a great help, and I, I shall see you again quite soon. Fargoth, the Wood Elf. Kind of silly name, I think. Then again, I am Brandar. Who am I to talk? Hello, kitten. What is your name? I'm Tyrus Jirbane. Welcome to the scenic Sadanin, gateway to Morrowind. Are you looking for someone in particular, or did you just want a little advice? I would like a little advice, indeed. You're bitter green, green outlander. Might as well wear a sign that says new in town. Word of advice, buy a little goodwill. Lose a few drakes, gain a friend. Folks loosen up if you spread a little of the Emperor's gold around. Well, I don't actually have too much gold uh, to my name. Perhaps you could tell me a rumor that might lead me into some more? I've heard that the local tax collector Process Vitellis is missing. No surprise, really. He wasn't well liked around here. Oh, this is a dangerous place, then. Hmm. Not too much around here. Ariel's trade house, the census and excise office. That's the Coast Guard, too, and the lighthouse, and that's it. Silkshire service goes to Vivek, Balmora, Nissus, and Surin. The road goes north past Pelgriot and Balmora, and east to Vivek, and southeast to Evenheart. Well, I uh, do need to get to Balmora, and I shall Is be on my way. Is there something I can do for you? It's been very lovely to meet you, lady. It's so nice people here just let you walk into their house, they're so welcoming. Oh, hello, how are you? I've never seen you before. Welcome to my house. Thank you so much. Can I take some things? See if we can't make a fair trade. That seems ideal. Oh, another Dunmer. Welcome to Cedic Sedanine, Gateway to Morrowind. Thank you so much. I think I spoke to you uh, a second ago. Go ahead, Outlander. What do you need? Outlander. Such a, a negative name to call someone, you know? Uh... Greetings, Ariel. Yes. Look at this. I am so persuasive with you, and we have only met this one time. Very lovely to meet you, my friend. Please, cannot shake hands. Claws, I just sharpened. But uh, I would like to barter with you. I am obviously lacking some weapons and some armor, and uh, perhaps I have some wares that might interest you. Wonderful. You are open to such a request. So I happen to pick up some bowls. If you like that. Mm -hmm. Some pitchers. Nice. Plates. Cups, forks, knives. We were having a banquet, you see, and they canceled at the last minute. Uh, how about the candelabra? Perhaps you need? Okay, I, I'm Kajit, I have night eyes, you know. Very big, see in the night. I can sell you the shoes. Beast Race doesn't wear shoes, you see. I have uh, pads on the bottom of my feet. They're quite squishy. It's fun to, to squish it when you're going to sleep. It helps me to, to nod out. Perhaps you have some some medium armor for me. Shame curious, yes. I think that's a good deal. Elf. I will take uh, a koi and a curious and I will be on my way. Lovely to meet you. Quite a nice start. Looking very good to me. Hmm. Alright. Oh, look at this. Silver. Bandar lies. Perhaps I will be back for you, Snake Staff. Don't mind me. <laughs> Hariskar Flatfoot, hello to you, sir. You look like you could use a friend, Outlander. Perhaps I can be your friend. I'd like you to help me recover some gold. Ah, uh, Brandar is always in the mood for gold. Please continue. That's right, see, I had a run of bad luck playing nine holes and lost a bit of money. Normally I'd be fine, 
We can usually keep some gold in our pockets just from the money these locals pay us for protection. But I know there some of them are holding out on me, especially that little Felcher Fargoth. He's come up late the past couple weeks when I shook him down. I know he's stashing it somewhere. I'd like you to find Fargoth's hiding place. Well, I'm quite fond of this Fargoth person. Perhaps uh, we can negotiate the price? I know the little fetcher has got one somewhere in town. I just don't know where yet. I've already gone through his whole house, so he's not hiding it there. I'd like you to find out where he's stashing his gold. If you can, I'll give you a share of the wealth. Are you up for it? A share of the wealth. Hmm. Well, I will do it. Excellent. Here's what I want you to do. I'm not sure where he goes, but I know he wanders around the town at night. Watch his movements. The best vantage point is on top of the lighthouse south of town. That'll give you a nice view of all of Sedanin. If you keep an eye on where he goes, I'm sure you'll be able to figure out where he's hiding that gold. Well, uh... You know, finders keepers, You've is what I say. Farewell, Mr. Hariskar. Thank you for the tip. I could use just a bit more gold, indeed. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friend.